What's going on everyone, it's Jim here, and in today's video we're talking about the best free online neuroscience resource that you can use to help get you through your neuroscience and neuroanatomy courses in PT school. And we're also going to be talking about why this resource is so important to use. So stick around because it's going to be some good stuff. And with that being said, let's get right to it. All right, now, before I go sharing the link with you guys, let's quickly talk about why it's important to know about this resource and to use it. And I've come up with four reasons, just making sure I got my numbers right. I got four reasons as to why it's an important resource to use. The first reason why this is important is because it's a trustworthy resource. It's developed by the University of Texas, a UT Medical Center at Houston. So we got a really trustworthy resource that we can use, and that's really, really important heading into this. All right, now the second reason why it's important to kind of talk about using this link and this resource is because it's free. And when it's trustworthy and it's free, that's really important. Because when you think about it, you're a student, you probably don't have a lot of money to be spending, and so whatever you can do to save money on things like textbooks is gonna be really important. Now I've also got some great information on my website about whether you actually need textbooks or which ones you should get while you're in PT school. So be sure to check that out. I'll put a link in the comment section, or no, the video description section below. All right, now the second reason why it's important to use this resource is because clinical neuroscience or neuroanatomy, whichever types of courses you're taking, they're notoriously tough. One of the things I would say is that most students tend to say that neuroscience or gross anatomy are the toughest courses in PT school. And so when you have a free resource that you can access that can make any aspect of neuro easier, it's gonna be really, really important to use that. All right, now the third reason why we wanna use this resource and why I wanna share it with you is because if you're a student in PT school, you're probably pretty broke, or at least you don't have a lot of money to be spending on textbooks and all these other types of resources. So whatever money you can save and get a free resource that's gonna help you out, that can come in really, really handy. And again, as you know, PT school, really expensive so saving money but doing it in a way that's not going to sacrifice grades or performance is pretty important all right now the fourth reason why this is a really important resource to use is because when it comes to pt school you got to keep your grades up if you can't keep your grades up man you are just walking a tightrope for academic probation and getting dismissed from the program and you don't want that so with neuroscience being really tough and with you needing to make sure you keep your grades up you gotta make sure that you're using resources that can help you in any sort of capacity possible. Now it's worth mentioning as well that there's other great resources out there that are trustworthy and free that you can use and find online for all things neuroscience and neuroanatomy related. Now I, I don't know about all of them so if you know some and you want to let other people know what you think they might be, make sure to put them in the comments section below for other people to check out. As well, I'd love to know what you're using that helps you out because anything that can help us out is great to have in our arsenal. Now, when we look at this online neuroscience resource, it's really, really cool to know that it has everything that you're gonna need for any type of neuroscience course that you're taking. It's got everything from the basics all the way up to things that you're gonna study in neuroscience for a PT school, like your, you know, your pain pathways and ascending and descending tracks, basic cellular uh, neurological functioning, you're gonna have things as well dealing with pain and kind of the actual anatomy of different you know, nuclei and other important structures to know that come along with neuroanatomy. And what's even better is the resource actually has a lot of great uh, kind of flash animations that you can use so that you can kind of click and kind of see a little bit of an animation of how these processes are unfolding. And so for a free resource that comes in incredibly handy because if you think about having a hardcover textbook or something like that, you know, you don't get animations with that. And while the animations in this free neuroscience resource, they're not exactly state of the art by any means, but they can help you understand, you know, things that's going on with different pathways and other processes that are happening within the body for all these neurological functions. So it's really, really cool to have that for a free resource. Now, as you'll notice when it comes to exploring the online resource, every chapter is written by someone who's a PhD in the respective field for that chapter. So again, that's great peace of mind for knowing that the information that you're getting is very accurate and very kind of trustworthy and reliable. Because the last thing you want is to find what you think is a great resource online somewhere for free, but it might not be as accurate as you need it to be for some of these kind of higher end clinical neuroscience and neuroanatomy courses that you might be taking. Now, I'll put the link on the screen here for you to check out. As well, I've got it in the description box below. And if you really want, I have a short little blog post 
That's kind of detailing a few more of these things that I haven't actually mentioned here in this video. So I'll put a link down to that resource for you to check out if you're curious about knowing a little bit more about what this online neuroscience course entails. So that's it for today's video. Hopefully you guys find this resource really, really helpful to use. Again, you can go to it over and over and over again. And when it comes to neuroscience and the courses that you take for that in PT school, man, you're probably gonna be going and using that a lot. So hopefully that's helping you out. Now, if you're getting great help out of some of this information that I'm giving in these videos or on my website, be sure to hit the like and subscribe button because that'll help me get some of this content out there to other individuals who could find it useful. So that's all I've got for today's video. Again, hopefully you're doing well. Hopefully you're crushing everything pertaining to PT school. Or again, if you're getting ready to go into school, you're just collecting all of these resources to again, help you out later on down the road. That's it for today. Hopefully you guys are doing well. We'll see you in the next video.